Good morning guys, it's Tuesday. This is like my favorite little spot to put my phone now. It's like on my windowsill because it's propped up and I can just sit and talk. Um, but it's Tuesday. Did I just say that? I don't know. Um, today I had class, so I did that. And then I'm trying to pull together a fashion shoe in four days. Well, today's Tuesday, so Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. I wanna do it Friday night, so I'm trying to do that. I haven't been able to call my location yet because they're closed today, but I have a week to get it handed in and that's kind of insane, but thankfully my model is also a makeup artist and a hairstylist, so she can kind of do that herself and I don't have to worry about getting anyone else to do it. And then today we have, well we don't have to, but I'm doing a commercial shoot, it's a bottle shoot, so I'm going to be doing Absolute Landing Vodka. And then doing like a little martini glass beside it as a little cocktail. And you know, I'm kind of glad that I'm not doing it in class because of the madness with everyone in there. I'm kind of doing it before my scheduled shooting time. But it's gonna be really funny to see um, everyone in class tomorrow because they're definitely gonna be drinking. And tomorrow morning I have class and lots and lots and lots of work to do. Always so much work to do, but that's college for you. We're getting down to the end of the semester, so. Exams are soon. Good morning, it is Wednesday and it's 9.13 and I'm all ready for class super early. I have class at 9.50 to 12.30 and then I have another class at 1.30 but I don't need to go to that one because it's a shooting class and I uh, did my assignment last night. So that's kind of nice and I don't have to be like rushed in the studio. I think I kind of talked about that earlier but that's what I'm doing my hair. I use like my little bun thing like the bun form and just the hair tie around it with a little I swear every week I say my room is a disaster but that's because I don't know why I can't keep it clean like I have clothes all over my bed my laundry hamper is full of like clean clothes my desk is just I think I just have a problem putting things away I have things on the floor that need to be returned but what my little project was this morning is um, my school bag that I was using was this and it's very big and it's very hard to like find things in there. Uh, yeah, it was just like really hard to find things in this really big bag and this flap never like closed properly because it's like a magnetic closure. So I transferred from this big bag. I thought it would be good, but I don't know. It, it was cheap. It was like three to five dollars and it's like getting really dirty. So this was my school bag. Oh, and caught on it. This is what I used last year. I don't know, it's always kind of had this. It's from H&M and I used it last year for a school bag and then for a purse over the summer, but it fits everything and I feel like it's just a more manageable size. So maybe I'll do what's in my school bag. Maybe I'll do that for my next video. I think I will. Probably end up filming that this afternoon after class. Today I have to clean the bathroom, clean the kitchen, and do dishes because, I don't know, I don't have to, but I'm going to be done class before my roommate, so we don't really have, like, you do dishes on Mondays, I do dishes on Wednesdays, it's just, like, whenever shit needs to be done, we just do it, and I feel like that's a pretty good way to live your life, but, oh, I keep getting caught on this handle, but this is my bag, it looks super big, but... I promise it's not as big as it looks. It fits my 13-inch uh, MacBook Pro perfectly. So that's all that really matters when I'm looking for a bag is to fit my laptop because my laptop is literally my life and my camera. But I don't know. I'm good. I'm bored. I need to finish my coffee and then brush my teeth. And my teeth are so yellow and stained and that's from coffee, I think. So I'm starting to drink coffee out of a straw. I don't know, I like really hot things anyways and I always use a straw for like everything, so I feel like it'll be okay. <sighs> my morning update, I guess. I don't know what else to say. I'm just sitting here looking out my window and all the cars are so frosty and it snowed uh, the night before yesterday, so the ground is all snowy, but then the snow kind of melted and now it's all frosty. And Canada's being really weird right now because the weather just can't decide if it wants to be nice or cold. And I'm okay with it not snowing. And most of that reason is because like 
I feel like I like the snow more, but since I drive, I hate driving in the snow. It gives me so much anxiety and I'm just so worried. And it's not even me, it's like worrying about other cars that are gonna like hit me. I don't know, I really don't like it. Okay, I'm gonna stop being weird now and finish my coffee, brush my teeth like I just said, and then head to class. So I'm about to clean my room. You're on a selfie stick in the corner of my bedroom. So if you, this is a weird angle right now. I don't know what I'm doing with my hands, but I'm gonna clean my room and let's get to it because there's gonna be a lot of work. this morning and some like veggies quickly. I'm going to eat this yummy poutine and it had some time to melt in like the hot container and oh it looks so good. So bad but so good. Good morning guys it's Thursday and I just got out of the shower so that's why the towel is on my head but today's my day off but that doesn't mean that I don't have things to do. I have so much to do today. I have to return a few things at like three different stores and I have to go and talk to a manager at this one place to see if I can do a photo shoot there tomorrow. She has not called me back, it's been like two days. So I'm gonna go in and try and talk to her today. And I need to pick up a few groceries. So I need to get ready, I need to get my butt in gear. I also need to hand in a project and write a psych discussion that is due today as well. So, busy busy day and I thought I would sit here and get ready with you guys. So, I'm just gonna do that. I haven't moisturized yet because I just got out of the shower, but I use the St. Ives Timeless Skin Moisturizer. Um, I like this because you really don't need a lot of it, so. And if I look down, it's because my mirror is right here. After I moisturize my face, I like to put some lip chalk on. I feel like my lips are just always, always so dry. This moisturizer also sinks in pretty fast. Then I use my Hard Candy Glamouflage Concealer just on my chin a little bit. It's like almost empty, I feel. I'm a very, very pale person and all the foundation shades are always way too light for me, but I finally found one that's too light for my skin and it's Hard Candy Glamouflage in Porcelain. It's the lightest shade, but this uh, Maybelline Fit Me is the lightest shade, but it's like dark. So I mix the two together and it's perfect for my skin. Sometimes getting the right ratio is a little weird and I don't know, sometimes it sounds up too pink but I kind of blend out my powder, kind of makes everything better. So I just mix that on the back of my hand with my fingers. And then sometimes I'll just like test a little bit on my neck to see what color I need more of. 
looks pretty good today. So I'm just gonna dab that all over my face. Yeah, so I have a bunch to do today. Um, it's pretty early though. I'm, I like to get early starts to my day when I have lots of stuff to do. So then I have all day to finish it and I feel productive. We have a panorama assignment due in one of my classes for like extra marks. So you just take a bunch of pictures and stitch them together in Photoshop. And I wanna do mine in like a Walmart aisle, but I'm really scared that they're gonna kick me out. So I'm gonna do it anyways, and then if they tell me to leave, I will just leave, but I'm going to try and do that today. I just use like a sponge as like a knockoff beauty blender to blend in my foundation. I really like it. Then I go back in with this concealer because it's pretty light and I just go under my eyes. that under there and that acts as like an under eye highlight and I just take my beauty blender again and just blend this in so I have the Too Faced shadow insurance primer so while my foundation sets I like to move on to my eyes What I do with my eye makeup depends on the day, but today I think I'm gonna go pretty simple. Um, I'm going to take this NYC palette and with like a big brush, take the lightest color and just put that all over my lid. And then with this brown color, there's like a purple up there, you can't even see that. I'm gonna take an angled brush and just put that all over in my outer corner and like these. It's not very like precise, but I just blend it out. And then taking this brush again, I just take a little bit more of that white shade and put it in my inner corner and blend it out just to lighten things up again if my that brown color got too far in. Today I'm going to do eyeliner. That also depends on the day. My face looks really oily, but it's because I haven't set my foundation yet. So again, I take this NYC liquid eyeliner and this stuff lasts all day. Like if I forget to take my makeup off, don't do that. It'll still be on the next morning. One eye down, there's my wing. And now the hard part is trying to match them. I tend to do my mascara last, so I'm going to go into my brows. My brows really stress me out, like doing my brows stresses me out. I'm just looking at my eyeliner, it's whatever, I'm over it. Mascara normally hides it, so. I take a little angle brush and like a light brown color, this one. It looks a lot darker on camera, but I just like lightly go over them. I really need to pluck them or go get them waxed or something because they're such a mess. Set so my foundation. I use this new Wet n Wild Coverall Press Powder in what is it? It's the lightest color. Fair. It's fair. 
and I just take this big elf powder brush and swirl it in there. It gets like really powdery. You can't you can't see anything I'm really trying to show you. So I have to like dab the extra powder off. I'm sure you know what I mean. And it gets everywhere and my carpet is covered in powder because like chunks fall off and then it just gets in my carpet. So I just blend that all in. Press it down. I do it everywhere, just, I don't know. And then blend it down. Then for blush, I use this NYC one in West Side Wine. Really hard to open, there we go. And just this blush brush. For highlight, I have this Hard Candy Glow on the Way Trio in Three Times a Lady, and I showed this in my Walmart haul in my last vlog. I take this e.l.f. stippling brush, I don't know, and I just like get it on the side of the brush and just go like this. And I really like to pack the highlight on. Um, I'm gonna do a little bit of bronzer. This is NYC Sunny. Just a little bit for my fair skin. because I think I went down too far a little bit and just put some of my foundation back over here and take my powder brush and just blend it out. There we go. Now it's time for mascara and my eyelashes are like nothing so curling them all the way. So my camera cut out but I just put on mascara and uh, like neutral pink lip and I am ready for the day. Um, just natural, this is basically what I do every single day so if you are wondering, that is that. Now I'm going to go get dressed and do my hair. Good morning guys, it's Saturday. Today is a no makeup day for me and a messy hair day because it's Saturday and my outfit today consists of a very large sweater with a little toothpaste stain, I think, and leggings. Very comfy, very classic. It's like, I've been up since 8.30, which sucks because let me sleep in, please. And um, I'm about to make a smoothie, so I'll show you like my very, very easy, simple recipe that I do when I make that. smoothies I just put strawberries in and these are like fresh strawberries that we froze them and then I add a little bit of yogurt normally strawberry because it adds a little bit of extra flavor this makes it creamy and then today I will be adding milk but sometimes I will add orange juice it really just depends on what I'm feeling that day, but I have to use this milk up, so it's gonna go bad soon. So I'm gonna use this milk if I can ever get it open. Okay, and I just fill this up to the top with milk. And I like to use frozen fruit because it kind of acts as ice. And I fill this pretty full with milk because I like it not to be too much. And I use um, a magic bullet. So like I said, my recipe is really, really easy. Sometimes I'll add pineapple or blueberries or whatever fruits I have, but I like mine creamy, so I use milk and yogurt. Super simple, like I said, but really easy if you're just like living in college. Good morning guys, it's Sunday. Well, it's noon. It's like, I think it just turned 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock, yeah. So I guess good afternoon. It's Sunday, but I decided to put a little bit of makeup on today, even though I'm doing literally nothing. But yesterday I didn't have any makeup on and 
Sometimes it just feels good, even if you're lying in bed all day watching Netflix, you just feel a little bit more put together. I don't know. But it's like Sunday, I just said that, but there are a lot of cars in the parking lot today. Can you even see that? I have no idea. But yeah, it's noon and I haven't eaten today. So I'm gonna make a little bit of cereal. I hate how bad the lighting in this kitchen is. So I need to put you guys down somewhere. Okay, you're balancing like coffee in my coffee maker. So I haven't eaten, but uh, I think I'm just gonna make a little bit of cereal. Today I'm gonna have some mini wheats and that's basically the only cereal I have. And This week's vlog hasn't been that super exciting so I'm gonna vlog a little bit this afternoon before I put this up I have actually been debating telling my friends and family um, I've been thinking about putting my YouTube link on Facebook because I watch how many people every single day and I don't think it's weird for that and I watch them happily so why do I think it's so weird that I'm doing it when thousands of people do it every single day? I don't know and they started out with no viewers and nothing and I don't know so I think I just really need to do it stop being so embarrassed there's another girl in my program and she does YouTube videos she just kind of does like weekly little uh not follow me around vlogs, but just talking to your camera kind of thing about topics that she wants to talk about, so. And people know about that, I know about that, she posts it, and she's cool with it, so. I think I really just need to do that. I'm gonna eat my cereal, I'm not gonna eat it here and talk to you guys. It just turned noon, so the Daily Bumps vlog is up, so I'm gonna watch that. Oh! I have literally done like nothing since I last talked to you guys, so it's been a few hours. It's such like a gloomy Sunday day and I was thinking about going for a walk but it's really cold out. It's like really windy and it's not comfy to go out and do that. So I think I'm just going to end the vlog for the week and edit and upload that now. I really hope that you guys are enjoying my videos. I'm having lots of fun doing them and editing them even though it's just very simple stitching clips together. But if you are enjoying them as much as I am, make sure to subscribe so you can see every video that I post. See you guys next time.